Everyone knows that eating rancid fat is bad for you, and one of the problems with that is that oxidizing fat, which is what makes it go rancid, is just part of good cooking. Fried food is objectively delicious, but in order to get those potato chips perfectly crisp, they have to be submerged in hot fat for a meaningful period of time. One of the problems from eating oxidized fats, especially the polyunsaturated fats that are probably less bad for you than the even more delicious butter and lard, is called malondialdehyde, or MDA. Now, I'm not going to tell you that potato chips cause cancer. In fact, I'm not going to say that potato chips cause anything other than happiness, because they are objectively delicious but everything in moderation, right? Because higher levels of MDA are associated with worse outcomes from cancer. Some amount of MDA is unavoidable, so of course our bodies have adapted ways to deal with it, like producing melatonin and getting regular exercise. And from the perspective of traditional medicine, herbs like Auklandia have been used with diets higher in oxidized fats to protect our liver and intestines from the problems they can cause. What do you know? They also reduce the damage from oxidized fats.